Alright, so we back. Like I said, I showed you earlier. We got the door hangers. They old, but they still my stuff. They still me. Still on me. Got some magnets. The magnet. That was the like original strongs. I didn't really like these. Like I like them. I like the field, but like, you know, the legibility ain't that great. I was thinking about like highlighting it to make it stand out more. But it is what it is. Now, <clears throat> when we got the brochures, I'm not really sure. How, like, it's weird because on the um, when I made the template on where I made the template on, I liked it. I liked it, but it was unfolded like this. Like that, I don't know how I feel. Like I don't know how I feel about that. I don't know. It, it, it is what it is. That's just how I feel. But it'll still be uh, worth it. And then in the inside, I think there's too much negative space. But it was all good. Like, for just preliminary promotion, trying to get some, like, get that conversation going. Um, like, I got the John in my bag, the paperwork and stuff in my bag. But this is the, uh, this is the pamphlet. Hopefully, like, right now, like I said, we already know what it is with that, but hopefully the hardscape, like, I got hardscape drawings, like, right here. Now, that, I can do it. I can do that. I can knock that out. I can knock that out right now. I don't got the equipment for that, but this is what we're promoting right now, and that's what I would tell people. I can knock this out. I can do that, but I don't got the equipment right now, but, you know, this is what I'm mainly aiming at in the uh, hardscape. Now, with all this negative space, like I said, on the on the computer this negative space looks like it's filled but when he printed out and like i said it's all good because it's the way i wanted it everything's good we got the sizes of the ponds we got the uh average cost of the hard skate per job estimates uh and then we got the estimates on land, uh land size by the acre i think i was trying to do acre and um square footage but whatever um and still that's just the estimate i would still have to see that the actual property i would put that now i forgot the must uh take that out but like i said it's preliminary hopefully we can drum up some type of business with this stuff and you know it'll be worth the investment price and then we got some business cards like i said so like you know i got some ideas i've already seen people make suggestions about where to uh like not contract business but you know something like that see this is the business card got my name number email the email for right now and then the ig now it has the um the bare canvas ig on it because, like I said in one of the other videos when I was doing that demolition for that backyard project, whatever you want to call it, um, the yard, I mean, because some people don't consider that a backyard, but whatever. Um, I, I, it's not there anymore, so uh, I couldn't access it that day, and when I went to look if it, the uh, IG was there today, I couldn't, it wasn't even there. So, uh, this is what we got, and... That's what we got. And like I said, I still got the door hangers. I want to somehow reinforce it. That would probably be a day project. Because right now, like, for me, it's like, I'll, this will work. I could throw it on the door and it'll be fine. But I want to, like, be able to staple the business card to that and maybe the brochure to it. Like, they had joints with pockets, but for whatever reason, I didn't get it. Because, you know, and I know PA, I don't know all over the place. Like, you can't really put stuff in the... Um, whether it's a pizza menu or whatever, you can't really put it in the um, mail slot. But this, and if you put, I, I have experience like doing that. So sometimes like you put it in the um, door handle, you put it in the door screen, whatever. And then five seconds later, you see it blowing past you down the block. So, um, and I, I get many of these, but you know, like I said, it's hopefully enough to, and I got a plan of attack with that. It's not like I'm going to just do certain things. So hopefully I don't, they don't go to waste or whatever. And, um, that's that. Like I said, I got, we, you get a, 
a magnet, a door hanger, and you might leave the magnet in the door hanger or the door hanger, see if somebody contacts you. I don't really want to do the door hangers right now, because like I said, I ain't got the landscape equipment, plus we're going into the winter, so um, fall, whatever you want to say, so, and then I had another John, a flyer where I was trying to, um, a flyer where I was trying to print out this flyer, because my, my printer's not working, so, yeah, I mean, um, I wanted to print out this flyer where it was like a special on the hardscape and aquascape. That way, it's still, like I said uh, in a different video, it's still some, you can still get some right now. Uh, you can still get some business doing uh, hardscape and aquascape. Like I said, when the sciatica hit this summer, it really knocked out the summer. And then, like, you know what I mean? Uh, was in that stop and go period. So that sciatica really, like right now my back hurts, but it's probably going to feel like this for the rest of my life. And like, this is something I can live with. I can work with it. I've done work with it. I've done the yard work. That first soiree with the yard work didn't turn out too good, but it is what it is. So hopefully, uh, like I said, we can drum up some business. Like I said, I've been, I've seen people and talked to people suggest on where you can contract with people. And uh, I definitely know places, I'm sorry, I gotta keep making sure that I ain't cut off. I definitely know places that uh, you can contract for landscaping, like different spots, but like, yeah, you know I mean, like I said, that's one, one tool, like if I got an aquascape job and a hardscape job, knock them both out before the winter hit or it gets too cold, then I would definitely be able to pay for a good amount of the uh, landscaping equipment. And if I was to get, like I said before, two or three of these type jobs before the winter really fully hits or gets too, and that's the thing, like I said, it's crazy because before, like right now it's super cold, but uh, the last like 10 years, it didn't really get cold until like the end of December. So, you know, hopefully it warms back up and I can knock a couple of these jobs out and then like, you know, invest in those, the rest of the uh, tattoo shop, continue doing this and even try to pick up some contracting jobs. But hopefully we can get something, build the portfolio more, get some contracting jobs, build the portfolio more, and then bang, boom, bang, we're still back at uh, square one with the original flagship. And then hopefully, you know, eventually things will work out with the field, but that is what it is for now.